Tonight I met secretly with a member of Angarda Sayochana. This member gave me the rundown of the way the Gardi work in Belina Garda station. I got an insight which shocked me as to what goes on even though I thought I knew it all at this stage. The member told me that they have no say in what goes on and if they don't follow orders life gets very tough for them. This member told me that in order to be in or to get promotion they must prove themselves by misdeeds and frame people. Only then are they in the circle. When in the circle they then get rewarded by receiving their cut in say for example drug sales and other scams run by their superiors. They also then receive protection so they won't be prosecuted and are apparently in with the judges also. This member also told me that there is a direct line to Belina Garda station from Garda HQ as regards myself and Com Granihan and all members in Belina have been told to provoke, harass and intimidate us and be careful of cameras when doing so. The member says it's common knowledge in Belina Garda station that the orders are coming from Noy Irino Sullivan and are being overseen by the superintendent. The member told me that quite a few Gardi were on our side and want the present establishment destroyed so the profession of being a Garda can become an honorable one. I was shocked to hear that there are certain Gardi who would do anything they are told to enhance their careers or get a bigger slice of the mafia pie. I always knew the Gardi were rotten and dangerous but was glad to hear there was concerns among quite a few of them to what's going on and that they didn't agree with the superiors. I told this member we needed more whistleblowers and that anyone seen in a Garda uniform represented corruption. The member agreed with me and looked to me for solutions. I told the member ACT was growing and that helpfully we would soon be able to help trapped Gardi too. The member told me that the scenario in Belina Garda station was probably true around the country also, and while the member admitted that the majority of Gardi were corrupted, the member was adamant there was also quite a few good ones. I told the member actions speak louder than words and that we would meet again soon.